what's up guys, Sir Cooper here from Rhyme Time TV, bringing you another video, and yes, I know it's been a very long time, and I am very, very sorry. Yeah. So, today I'm going to be telling you a story about something, <laughs> something crazy that just happened recently, uh, that I'm not proud of, but I, I'm not, I'm, I'm more of the victim. You feel me? I'm I'm more of the victim than anybody else was in this six six the six situation. What the fuck is the situation? In this situation. So let me explain. Okay, so a couple days ago, me and my friends were we was kind of hungry. You know, we we're tired. We wanted to go get something to eat, so we went to Subway. And then after Subway, I'm like, man, I forgot my chips. I'm like, okay. Let's stop by the gas station on the way to back to the old house. So we stopped by a Speedway, and I walk into the Speedway. I kind of have a feeling that I want some donuts, but then I see these Doritos. I'm like, okay, I have a syrup. I get some Doritos. So I walk over to the Doritos, and I reach for them, and an old lady is reaching for them at the same time as me. And I'm like, okay, uh, this is, uh, I don't want to be rude, but I'm hungry. I snatch them. I, 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 I just, I, I just I'm snatching them, get them, I was hungry, but I snatch them, and I'm like, oh, ma'am, I'm so sorry, I didn't, I didn't know that you wanted these, it was the last bag, trust me. I knew that she, let me pause this game, trust me, I knew that she wanted them, so I get them, and I walk past her, now this lady, obviously, she knew violence pretty well, she, I, she knew violence pretty well, because when I walked past her, she stuck her cane out and tripped me, I'm heavy, so that was a big fall for me, I fell down, I landed on the bag of Dorito, and they spread out a little bit, and the bag bust. I'm, I'm a little mad. I'm a little sad. So I scoop them. This is five second rule. God, man, dirt, dirt, don't hurt. And I look over and I go, and the lady is stepping towards me, and I put my leg out, and I just, I mean, mm, in her in her knee, but I was like, pow, right in her knee. She was, oh, I knew she had arthritis. She was going to fall down. So then I got up, I ran over to the counter, put the chips on the counter. And as I was about to pull out my wallet, as I was going in, she came behind me with her cane, bow in one knee, bow in the other knee, and I fell down. I'm like, ow, that hurt like a mother father. She reaches over me. She pays for the Doritos, snatches them, and walks out. So if I'm over my knee, I get out, I'm like, well, who the heck was that? He like, yo, man, that old lady just hit you in the uh, kneecaps with her cane. You you just got your ass beat by an old lady with a cane. I'm like, well, where are the Doritos at? She, she took them bitches, too. So I'm mad. I walk out. I see her about to get into her car. I run over. My boy like, yo, what you doing? I said, wait a minute. So I walk over there, and I turn her around, and I snatch my bags. But as she's turning, and I'm snatching, a fist is coming out of nowhere. And it connects with my jaw. You heard that? That's what happened. And I fall. And she's like, who do you think that you grab it? You done fucked up. She put the Doritos in the driver's seat. Now, I don't know if you've ever made somebody so mad next to a car that they put they food on the driver's seat and close the door and lock it. But when they put their foods in their car, they close the door and lock it. I'm pretty sure that means that they want their food to be more and more safe than your life. So she comes up and she stands over me. And at this point, I'm like, uh, 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 I don't... I think this old lady about to fuck me up. Fuck her wrong. Old lady. Damn, I just cracked my eye. I mean, what? Just cracked my eye. How do you do that? 
But this lady is coming up to me. And usually old lady had that whole oh, and it was He was like, oh, t-. nigga, what the fuck you just say? She went from, ah, t-. oh, yeah. So then she's like, yeah, get up. Come on, get up. So she's walking over me. And as I hear her voice, I'm starting to think, okay, maybe I just messed with the wrong transsexual. I did not know her voice was very white deep and shit. So she comes walking over me, and I'm feeling like she about to lift up her dress, and there's going to be a very large penis hanging right there, and I'm scared. So I close my eyes, and I tuck my head, and I feel something pounding my butt. Now, listen, don't take that sentence I said and used it in the wrong context. When I say pound in my butt, I don't mean sexually inside me. I just mean something like like hitting me on the butt. And so I'm thinking, oh, this old lady just took out her penis and trying to butthole me, and I don't want that. So then it's hitting me and hitting me, and eventually I open my eyes, and I see a wall. I'm like, what the heck? And all of a sudden I hear, wake up, wake up. So I open my eyes and I roll over and it's my mom hitting me saying, wake up, wake up. And I'm like, what happened? More of the story is, turned out I fell off of my bed dreaming butt naked. Yeah, I slept naked and I fell off my bed. I don't think I've ever had a dream like that before, and I don't know if I ever want to have a dream like that again. But yeah, don't try to fight transsexual grandmothers over a bag of Doritos and Speedway after getting a Subway sandwich. It don't work out too well. But hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you like that story, leave a like and a comment. I'm your boy, Sir Cooper, signing out. Deuces, and remember, if you got some food, share it with me. If you don't, I'm going to kill you. Not really, but it never hurts to share a bowl of ramen noodles. <laughs> Peace out. Catch it. Ooh.